Hey guys, today we brought you to Smithville, Mississippi because we want to introduce you to Mississippian comedian, Grand Ole Opry extraordinaire, Rod Brassfield. Come along with us. Let's go explore. Rodney Leon Brassfield was born on August 22, 1910 in Smithville, Mississippi. He began his career in the 1920s with the touring dramatic show serving as the straight man for his older brother, Boo Brassfield, who was an actor and comedian as well. George Hay recruited Rod for the Grand Ole Opry in 1944. Rod had a trademark look a baggy suit, a rubbery sort of face, and a messed up hat. Rod poked fun at country life, but he could make you laugh without even talking. In 1948, Rod formed a double act with the Grand Ole Opry's Minnie Pearl. She called this double comedy, where the two of them would deliver alternating punchlines and neither played the straight man. Rodney was a ventriloquist and his dummy's name was Bocephus. Hank Williams Sr. nicknamed his young son, Hank Jr., Bocephus, after Rodney's dummy. Rodney also worked with June Carter and Elvis Presley. Rod played an ex-con sidekick of Andy Griffiths in the movie A Face in a Crowd in 1957. In 1958, Rod appeared in Country Music Holiday, which was his final film role. His final resting place is here in this little country cemetery just outside of Smithville, Mississippi. Rod is another great example of a Mississippian who excelled at the top of his game. Oh yeah, and by the way, if you like this kind of content, hit that like button. Heart failure, along with the ongoing problem of alcohol abuse, led to Rodney's death. On September the 12th, 1958, he was just 48 years old. Rod Brassfield was inducted into the Country Music Hall of Fame in 1987. If you've never heard of Rod Brassfield, or Minnie Pearl for that matter, I want to encourage you to search for them on YouTube. You're sure to get a laugh. And as always, thank you. <laughs>